shocking creatures that are not from this planet. Our planet is full of surprising creatures, some with distinctive features and gigantic sizes, others with their magical alien looks. We already know that we've only discovered 5% of the oceans and are nowhere near to complete our search of the planet. So many places to still explore, and whenever we do explore something, there's always something shocking lying in wait. Hello, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we'll be showing you shocking creatures that are not from this planet. So sit down, relax, and keep watching. You're one of those people who always think fish would be preferable with just a little bit of lipstick. Well, you're lucky because it turns out evolution also felt the same way, which is why it decided to bestow one batfish with a nice red lip. A team of sea divers was charmed after they recorded some unusual clips of a strange fish. The red-lipped batfish is a rare fish with many unique evolutionary adaptations not only for its physical features, but it's also able to walk as this vicious body is modified to the point that it can rest on the seafloor and can move as well. Believe it or not, this fish really exists and can walk all the way in the sea. This bacteriophage-like creature puzzled everyone when the footage was released to the public in 2008. Shell Company claimed that they recorded the figure hanging around on one of their oil platforms it was eventually identified as a long-legged sea creature called the Magnapina squid, which is a group of rarely seen cephalopods with a distinctive morphology, but no one is sure about the theories put forward after the discovery of this creature. Even to this date, many insist that it could be evidence of alien life. People's reaction to this video is thought-provoking, as many of them believe it might be related to an octopus or jellyfish. Barrel eye fish found in the ocean's twilight zone at depths of the Indian Pacific and Atlantic waters. Here's another shocking creature from the ocean, the barrel fish, also known as spook fish because of its weird green glowing tubular eyes protruding from its head. These eyes generally gaze upwards to detect the silhouettes of available prey and can also be directed toward allowing it to sense predators. Even stranger about this fish is its fluid-filled transparent dome-shaped head of soft tissues that work with its telescoping eyes to filter out sunlight, which basically works as sunglasses. This bizarre fish is rarely spotted, and marine scientists could only encounter the fish nine times. Just when you think the most terrifying fish to encounter is a great white shark, we introduce you to a living fossil, the rare deep-sea goblin shark with a lineage dating back about 125 million years. It's a pink-skinned monster with a flabby body and small fins that suggest it's sluggish in nature. The terrifying creature has an elongated shovel-like snout covered with special sensing organs that help it sense electrical fields in deep waters. Its creepy jaws contain nail-like teeth that quickly project upon its prey. Fortunately, divers don't come in contact with them often, as they live at depths of up to 3,300 feet. There's no doubt that miniature-sized things always gain the most attention. And what if these adorably cute miniature-sized things are actually living animals? Sounds impossible to imagine. Let me introduce you to a teeny tiny monkey that weighs less than an apple. The finger monkey is the smallest species of monkey and one of the smallest primates in the world that grows no longer than nine inches, including its tail. They're tiny enough to cling to your finger, even though these pint-sized fur balls are adorable, we can't have them as pets because they're wild and make a lot of screeching sounds, and even throw feces when angry. The monster from the deep is one of the two heaviest bony fish and is native to tropical and temperate waters around the world. It resembles a fish head with the tail having a huge round body flattened laterally, moving its large fins slowly. The giant fish floats underwater and comes up to the surface to sunbathe, hence getting the name sunfish. This unpredictable creature has been known to swim in a large school, but often swims alone as well. If you ever encounter a sunfish, you'll feel as if it's staring at you, wanting to take an underwater walk with you. A pair of paddleboarders were overwhelmed when they encountered an enormous sunfish in the ocean near Laguna Beach who claimed it was an animal from some other planet. Although not the heaviest, but the largest known anthropod found at depths of 600 feet, say hello to the Japanese spider crab. 
At first glance, it looks like a pile of hundreds of ancient monsters crawling over one another. However, it's not as it seems. These dozens of crabs are gathering here to get rid of their older shell, just like someone takes off his shirt. They do so to grow up. Their body is covered with a thorny protective exoskeleton with ten giant legs having small spikes called turbicles and span wider than two fully grown men. These creepy creatures are limited to the Pacific side of the Japanese islands, where they often inhabit the sandy and rocky bottom of the continental shelf and slope. A lady discovered some bizarre carcass on the coast while taking kids on an educational trip off the island shores that literally seemed from a parallel universe. Spectators started calling it a sea serpent, but that actually was a deep sea monster. A long oarfish that spanned the length of about three people was found dead. Fish with a belly full of planktons. The beast weighed from 150 to 200 pounds. It might be 24 feet long when it was alive, but it was about 15 feet when it washed ashore. According to researchers, it's nine feet tall, was severed from its body as oarfish are known to shed weight and save energy by severing their tails to escape predators. Sarcastic Fringe Fish It has an awesome name with an attitude to match. The Sarcastic Fringe Head is a big, mild, bullshy blenny that lives in the temperate coastal waters of California. These strange fish hang out in the ocean floor dens which can be burrows, empty shells, or even discarded plastic bottles. The male defends its territory from other fringe heads by dropping caustic one-liners. Riled individuals actually face off by slamming their huge open mouths together Laterally splayed jawbones and sail-like cheek membranes reveal a purple tongue, a double row of teeth, and a fluorescent yellow mouth rim. It's basically a who's-got-the-biggest-mouth competition where the victor bags the best in and wins a chance to mate. A weird seaweed floating was found in the waters of South and East Australia. The leafy dragon is a perfect name for it. Apparently, it looks like a simple leafy tangles but it's actually alive, and its discovery is proof that the ocean still holds many secrets. The only way to identify it is to look for its eyes, long tubular snout, and fins on its neck and back. The most interesting part is the way it moves for food. Its coloration and leafy appendages give it an excellent camouflage on kelp-covered rocky reefs. Like other seahorses, the male takes care of the eggs until they're born. This creature was declared critically endangered as a lot of Australian divers started looking for it to keep it as a pet. Those were all the mysterious creatures on our list. We hope we made you curious to learn more about them. If you like this video, please leave us a fat thumbs up, share and subscribe to keep updated on more videos like this. We'll see you in the next one. And as always, take care and goodbye.